it's just been a, a steep learning curve. That is, that is for sure. It's like seeing these looks <laughs> from over here. I'm like, that's so. If, like, if you, you see the if you job. see the insides, you know it's not it's, it's not as pretty. But luckily, <laughs> but luckily, no one will, will see that. You know. I'm, I'm Christian Fuda. I am a senior in industrial design. My last my last semester here, and decided to dive into art to wear and give it a shot. So I've always been interested in fashion design, specifically footwear design, um, which is kind of how I found industrial design to begin with. And when I came to NC State, I was really torn originally between what kind of program I wanted to go into, whether it was industrial design, fashion design, even textiles. Um, but ended up in industrial design and um, really, really loved it throughout the years. But um, I always had this draw, underlying kind of draw towards um, fashion design um, and decided, you know, in my last semester, I kind of had like sat back and was, you know, thinking about the year and was like, you know, I, I think I'd regret not at least trying to do art to wear. The start of my senior year, I kind of took a moment to kind of like reflect and like, you know, I have to figure out what I want to do. Just kind of look back on my time. Um, and that's where the perspective came into play originally. It was just the um, perspective of, you know, look, you know, looking at everything in a new way, whether it's what I'm going to be doing next or um, looking at myself and, you know, that underlying sort of desire to do fashion design and footwear design um, that has stayed consistent throughout since high school, middle school even. And I wanted to play with this idea. It's a color and light theory called chromatic aberration which is essentially when uh, there's a distortion or um, just something is kind of blocking your view, whether it's a lens or um, it's just a refraction of light. It's a blurred look, but when you look closely, it's actually just separation of light into dark blue, light blue, red and yellow. And I kind of wanted to take that idea and be like, okay, well, from afar, it could just look blurred and distorted, but if you change your perspective on it and you get closer, it's actually these brilliantly vibrant, beautiful colors. And yeah, uh, over the years I kind of had a few times where I, I strayed from the, the footwear design path or kind of questioned, you know, if I wanted to limit myself just to that. Um, but once my senior year hit, I kind of just realized, you know, like I've, I have other projects that I've worked on that's not just footwear, but this is what I want to do. I've, I've known I've wanted to do this for a very long time and I was kind of just fighting with it for some reason for a couple of years. Um, but you know, figured, figured I'd give it a shot and kind of make kind of one final um, collection that um, kind of describes me and my, my journey over the years at, uh, at State here, yeah.